We are working with Word Multi Project 1. Currently, we're on the rock crawling project. Task 1 asks us to go to page 2, find the Moab, Utah, and we're going to make a bookmark out of it. Now, notice how it highlighted that picture. That's too much. You want to make sure that you select just that text. We're going to go to the Insert tab. In the Links group, we're going to click Bookmark. We'll bring this up for you to see. We're going to go ahead and type in Moab, click Add, and we've gone ahead and completed that task. That's inserting a bookmark. Let's go ahead and replace all of the climbing with crawling. So we're going to go to our Home tab, and in our Editing group, you're going to find the word Replace. Go ahead and click that. I'm going to type in Climbing. We'll go ahead and do Crawling. We're going to click Replace All. You'll get this message because of where we're at in the document. Click Yes. We'll click Yes again. And then it'll tell us that they made two changes. We'll go ahead and click Close. Click Mark Completed. And move on to Task 3. Tells us on the bottom of page two. So we're on page two. We'll go to the bottom, starting with the text mountain locations and highlighting all the way over to the depending on equipment. We're going to select that text. Now it wants us to change this text to a table, which is pretty simple to do. With that text selected, make sure you don't select too much down here or up here, or it will mess up your table. We're going to go to the insert tab. We're going to click the table and we're going to click um, convert text to table. And it tells us to accept all defaults, so yeah, two columns is what we need. And we've gone ahead and created that table from the text. On page one, we're going to go ahead and replace the current set of bullets. And it says that we want to match it to the one that's on the right. So with that selected, I'm going to go ahead and click the bullets drop down box. And I'm on the home tab. We're going to go ahead and select these bullets. It's completed that task, so click that. And then on, we're going to add the cover page. So we're going to click the insert over here on the pages. You have the cover page. And it wants us to go ahead and select this one. So we'll go ahead and do that. And that completes that task. 